Right here for just me. Great, thanks. Bar of soap and you'll wash ashore. Now, all these seats are the same, brown and uncomfortable, so once you find a seat you like, please remain seated throughout the entire journey, keeping your hands, arms, feet, and legs inside the boat. And parents, please watch your children, because we are clear and out of here. Wave goodbye to the dock. And wave goodbye to all the lovely people on the dock. You'll never see them again. Yeah, you've never seen them before. You're not really going to miss them. It's all right. Wave goodbye to my fans. Bye. Yeah, the ceiling fans, not those people who didn't wave back. Cool. All right, welcome aboard the World Famous Jungle Cruise. We are world famous for being famous around the world. Uh, my name is Sam. I'll be your skipper, social activities director, trail guide, dance instructor. And if you don't laugh at my jokes, I can be your swimming instructor. <laughs> Fantastic. Well, we're now in the Amazon rainforest. On the left and the right, we've got some beautiful butterflies. Now, those butterflies can have a wingspan of anywhere from one foot all the way up to a whopping 12 inches. Yeah, we do like to refer to them as the rulers of the jungle. True monarchs. And in the Amazon rainforest, it does rain up to 365 days out of the year. And by my calculations, that's almost every other day. Now, on the left is Inspiration Falls. The reason they call it Inspiration Falls, it is said that the longer and longer you stare at it, the more and more it inspires you to go. Uh, deeper and deeper into the jungle, of course. Can everyone say, ooh? Ooh. Everyone say, ah. Ah. Yep, sounds like inspiration to me. Let's keep on going. <laughs> We're now on the Congo River. We'll see how far this boat can go. Yeah, I'm my driving, who knows? <laughs> right here's the Jungle Book, so if you've never seen it before, there it is, there it goes. Amazing. <laughs> Up ahead, we do have a pygmy welcoming party, dancing, music, and fun times had by all. No one showed up. Okay, this is awkward. Because they left the war canoes on the beach, but I don't see anyone out there. Canoe? No, something must have scared them off. <laughs> Probably that giant python over there. Uh, but don't worry, they're very friendly creatures. No, they can even develop a crush on you. Although it will turn into a very constricting relationship, not something you want to get wrapped up in, believe me. <laughs> believe me. Oh, come on, guys, stop monkeying around. I hired you to help me break camp, not break everything in my camp. Uh, but on the bright side, I could not get that jeep to start. They finally got it to turn over. Yeah, probably used a monkey wrench. I should have thought of that earlier. Oh, well. We're now on the Nile River. The Nile River is the longest river in the world. It stretches on for Niles and 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 Niles. And if you don't believe me, you're probably in... Denial. Africa. Yes, because that is an African bull elephant, the second most feared animal in the jungle. And right here, the number one most feared animal is mother-in-law. <laughs> Up ahead, lovely sandstone rock formation. Not many people actually take the time to appreciate it. They just take it for granted. I think it's one of our bolder attractions. It really rocks. I like to marvel at it. Well, we're on the Great African Belt now. It is home to wildebeest, giraffes, impala, zebras, lions. Oh, look at that. We've got a pride of lions protecting a sleeping zebra. How nice of them. You know, it's interesting how zebras sleep on their side, surrounded by lions, with their necks slightly bent. Yeah, that zebra sure does look dead. Tired, dead, tired. Yeah, we'll just let them rest in pieces and uh, continue on here. Oh, boy. Well, we found the lost safari party. Oh, there's my friend Ina. Everyone say hi, Ina. Hi, Ina. Uh, she's great. You know, I did tell those guys before they left, don't argue with the rhino, because they will always get their point across in the end. Yeah, if you find yourself in a similar situation, don't try and outrun the rhino. Just run faster than the person beside you. You should be all right. <laughs> and now, does anyone here believe that old saying, the captain goes down with the ship? Raise your hand if you believe that. Great, what's your name? Thank you for volunteering to be our captain. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not your captain, I'm your skipper. I will skip away at the first sign of danger. <laughs> now this right here is beautiful Schweitzer Falls. Schweitzer Falls, named after the famous German explorer and the founder of the Jungle Navigation Company, Dr. Albert Falls. Yeah, good old 
Dr. Falls. Uh, we'll go over that later, don't worry. <laughs> okay, that is a crashed airplane. You know what that means. Hippos. Hippos. Why did it have to be hippos? Okay, you got to be careful making it through here. Now, they might look friendly, but don't let them fool you. They're actually very territorial, and they've been known to capsize boats before. Just last week, they sank six boats. But don't worry, out of those six, only five were mine. Duck! Sorry, it's a duck. Oh, so we made it through, though. Oh, we're now in headhunter territory. Well, this is a terrible place to be headed. Yeah, if you don't believe me, you can ask my last crew right over there. Although they were a bunch of boneheads. All oh, right, up there we got the natives. Looks like they're celebrating something. Either that or they lost the key to the men's room. Anyway, now around here I was told to look for a native am bush. That's some sort of bush. I think they said it was over here. Oh! Hey guys, how's it going? I don't, don't mind them, they're just practicing their Shakespeare. A pro or not to pro? That is the question. Uh, keep up the great work, guys. I'll see you later. And here we are, the eighth wonder of the world, the amazing, stupendous, colossal, backside of water! here in the jungle. If you like science jokes, I've got some about oxygen and potassium, but they're just okay. Yeah, I tell chemistry jokes periodically, they never get a good reaction. Oh well, we're on the Mekong River now, deep in Cambodia. And I don't remember the entrance to the temple being here. Should we head inside? Yeah, sure, let's do it. All right, all right. Over there on the tree bark, that is a dog biscuit. 
Yeah, there's one right there at my eye level. That is an eye viscous. Yeah, there's one back there in the water. That is a sea viscous. And then there's one way back there. Well, that's an onion viscous. Now, now, I do want to thank you for joining me here on the world famous Jungle Cruise. Out of all the crews I've had, you have definitely been one of them. And uh, certainly been the most recent, so thank you for that. And now's a good time to thank our sponsors. Today's Jungle Cruise was brought to you by Animal Crackers. Teaching children all around the world that all animals taste the same. Delicious. Also brought to you by Zebra Jerky, the every other, every other, every other white meat. The Cannibal Cafe, always thinking of new and exciting ways to serve you. And last but not least, the Miracle Boat Engine Company. They say if you make it all the way around the jungle, it must be a miracle. <laughs> and we're almost there. Let's just uh, hope we make it the rest of the way. Now up ahead on the left, that is our head salesman of the jungle, Trader Sam. I gotta tell you, he runs a pretty cutthroat business out here and his sales have been shrinking. But he's always got a killer deal going on. Killer deal. And today's deal, let's see what it is. Oh, that is fantastic. All right. Like I said, Trader Sam always has a killer deal going on. Right now it is three of his heads for one of yours. Does anybody want to take him up on that fantastic offer? <laughs> that one? It's a great deal. Head and shoulders above his competitors. Either way, you slice it or dice and you will always come out ahead. No? All right. Well, here we are, the most dangerous part of our journey, the return to civilization. So, for your continued enjoyment and your odds of survival, please remain seated, keeping your hands, arms, feet, and legs inside the boat until we get to that dock over there. Now, there is a dock on the left and a dock on the right. It's a little confusing. A uh, bit of a paradox. Yeah. Well, I just thought of something. If people who eat vegetables are called vegetarians, you could call Trader Sam a real humanitarian. <laughs> yeah, he just loves serving people. He's a really great guy. Always having strangers for dinner. In fact, just the other week, my girlfriend and I were over at his place for dinner, and I told him, Sam, your wife makes a great stew. He said, thanks, but I'm gonna miss her. Yeah. Fun fact about Trader Sam, first out of his family to get into college. Unfortunately, he did get kicked out. He was caught buttering up his professor. <laughs> yeah, real shame it was. I do apologize for those cannibal jokes. I know they're a bit hard to swallow. Some might even say they're in very poor taste, but just take them with a grain of salt. Maybe some pepper, a little bit of hot sauce. All right, now, once again, watch all hands, arms, and elbows as we do approach the dock. I don't want you to scratch up the dock. It's very expensive. Now, we laugh together. We cried together. Guys, we very nearly died together. together. Some would say that makes us like a family. But like any family, 12 minutes stuck together in a small enclosed space is far too long. Yeah, get out. Everyone stand Sorry, up. Please get out. Thank you. Bye, thank you. there we have it. Hope you enjoyed the tour of the Jungle Cruise. <laughs>